beautiful day here in Berlin and we've got a couple of things to do today. We're coming to the what they call Middle Berlin, um, Berlin Concert Hall, I'm going to call it because it says Concert House Berlin. So I'm just using my great German to work out that's the Concert Hall. Uh, beautiful part of Berlin, some great old buildings, but we're here to, firstly we're going to meet with uh, Dyson CEO to find out what Dyson's up to. And we're going to head down to Samsung's main press event here for IFA uh, and check out what's coming from Samsung. We're just about to go into Dyson and we're going to have a chat with their global CEO about what's happening with Dyson and uh, what's next for Dyson. CEO of Dyson is uh, Max Ponson. Max Ponson, you're going to be right there, Max. Yeah, hey, how are you? So great chat with uh, a very uh, very important man, a global CEO of Dyson. But one of the things he mentioned was they were going to do a lot of this. These are people on the streets of Berlin using the Dyson vacuums because they just want people to use them and see them because they know that there's imitations out there. He said to me, I said imitation is the greatest form of flattery. He said it's irritating. So imitation is the greatest form of irritation, according to Dyson CEO. And if you want to check one out, I figure this will come to cities around the world because I think they're liking this approach of showing people the product. Right, so here's a great story. In East Berlin in 1961, this little guy became the symbol for walk and stop across the road. So this guy's the walk across the road symbol in all the traffic lights. And what's really cool about that is it became a cult figure. You know, this was East Germany under Russian rule, one side of the wall, and now the Ample Man or Ample Man is such a cult figure there's merchandise with it on, there's stores, and it's still the uh, traffic light symbol across parts of Berlin, mainly East Berlin, for walk and there's a different guy for stop. Dyson events finished, had a great chat with the CEO, and now we're gonna grab a cab, an Uber, and uh, head over to Samsung's events at a, um, looks like a pretty interesting venue. Well, I guess this could be case of one extreme to the other. We just come from Dyson, where big company, lots of money, but a very simple, small event in a, in the, a city block, a city building in Berlin. Samsung doing it slightly differently at this uh, huge venue here. I think we're about to see a completely different style of event uh, kicking off IFA 2017. <laughs> Good afternoon. Welcome to the Samsung Press Conference here in Berlin. That's Samsung's event done. Um, now we do have a little uh, somewhat top secret meeting. I don't know, uh, I'll have to think about when this is uh, gonna be seen before I tell you what that is, but I'm gonna try and catch up with someone who has some product for us, uh, which we're gonna show on the Today Show Friday morning, Sydney time. So let's get in the cab and see if we can find it. Alexanderplatz, uh, which is in a uh, kind of a suburb of Berlin called the Berlin Mitte, and uh, we first thought the Mitte might mean uh, as in Trans Mitte because there's a massive transmitter tower here, which is I don't know, let's call it the Fernsturten, but we're just going to call it the tower, uh, main broadcasting TV tower, and I'm sure there's a lot of uh, mobile and radio up there as well. But a uh, pretty iconic part of Berlin. Not sure we can get up. Not sure I want to. I get some food uh, before we go and meet our man, who's probably going to meet us at our apartment with some gadgets for the Today Show.
I'm reliably told that you two fans will appreciate this statistic. Um, Achtung Baby was recorded in Berlin, and this car behind me, the Trabant, which was uh, produced from like the 60s till 1990, um, was used uh, as the lighting for the, the tour for that album. They had Trabants all the way around the stage shining down uh, as, the, as the concert lighting. This thing they made 2.8 million of. It's a four speed, very basic, two door car. This is uh, pretty representative of East Germany for over a very, very long period of time. The Trabi now sits with artistic works on it around plenty of Berlin tourist shops. So we've just had a great uh, great steak here in uh, Berlin, actually, at uh, the Blockhaus, uh, apparently making the best steak since 19-something or other. Uh, so, Ches Nissendan on that one. Uh, gonna get a cab back to the hotel, gotta start working on the Today Show script and story for tomorrow night. Um, and the new day starts again tomorrow.